Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And earlier today, I purchased this Mamba on sale. And, of course, I had to do it up so it looks exactly like the one that you kept to steal in one of, the, one of the nightclub business battle missions where you have to fly in and or drive up and blow the back of the door off of a truck and then this car appears and you have to drive it back and I thought, you know why couldn't we keep that car? And so that's that's what I've done is I've tried to recreate exactly that car. So it's like I just grabbed one out of the truck and kept not only the weapons that were in it, but the the car itself. And so that was great. And of course as I did all this I did a wonderful commentary to absolutely nothing because I didn't have the, the, the software loaded to record video. Thought I was doing all that, didn't do all that. So here's a summary. There it is. Look, it's got the, it's got the racing green paint, the right livery, big bore exhaust, stock wheels. That's about all you have to do. And of course, I gave it full mods so it's you know like i got the uh the engine uh upgrade the turbos the whole nine yards i don't think i lowered the suspension i think i lowered it once and then brought it back up because i think that looks better looks closer to what the reality is um what else there's like things could have been lost i sold i think i, I think i have a video where i sold off my other 57 i i upgraded this back to from being the green peyote that i had now it's a peyote which actually if you really look at it very closely depending especially in different light matches the color of my jammies it looks a little darker in here it looks a little bit brighter outside but this is my jammies peyote and it's all set up i'm very fond of this i'm suddenly extremely fond of this and i'm not exactly sure why i mean it's good but it's like i feel like this is like my new personal cruiser kind of thing here it's, it's an important car to me now I sold off the pink peyote, which is, I don't think of it as selling it off. Think of it as being sent off to be turned into a gasser peyote, which I was going to buy one of those, I think, as soon as they go on sale, or until I desperately want one. But, I mean, eventually we're going to have that. That's going to happen. And I decided to try, try to save this hot knife by giving it the, the kind of unofficial or official, I guess I can make it official, livery of the nightclub because these are the colors that match the interior of the nightclub if you go for the top end hoity-toity interior for your nightclub and i don't know does it work for you i mean it's this close to selling the thing i mean it's not a fantastically fast car but at least it at least it now matches the look of the um the runabout futo that i have the 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 errand car Futo for the for the for the nightclub. It's it's a nightclub car. Now let's let's move on here because there are other things to do tonight. Now this of course is the the Patriot limousine which I have updated. I still have yet to get a mission for the nightclub where I get to see if this gets used as opposed to the plain Jane white one. I'm hoping I'm hoping I get to use a fully powered up turbo version of the uh of the limo but you're thinking well why are you bringing this up right now well, let me let's uh let's go to a different garage in some of the lost footage well not really lost footage i didn't take the footage i was thinking that since this patriot is really the most uh, available and generic of my patriots because it's fully modded up i mean it's got all the current options kind of things. Well, not all. I didn't put the light bar on it. Um, it has. It, this is something that it went into uh, Los Santos Cubs Customs. We put the uh, exhaust on it. It's got off-road tires. It has a livery. You can. You can. But you can. You can make this one anytime you want. My other Patriots. One is my original Patriot, which went through Los Santos Customs. But now, if I take it back in there, some of the parts on it will be stripped away. It's, it's something that you can't get again. I have one that has all of its parts stripped away, which I have a feeling if they ever fix that, then that will be something rare. And, of course, I have this one, which is kind of this. It was just my brawny kind of very, you know, hunter masculine kind of 
awesome drum. But it's really, you know, I, you know, it's not something special as far as vehicles go yet. Do you see where I'm going here? Why don't we make this one kind of a shorter version of the limo? I mean, which it is a shorter. It's a Patriot. It's not a Patriot stretch. But we can, when we could do this up, it's already got, I think, the right livery. I might leave the off-road tires. I might, you know, just leave this, you know, this let's be the the beefy going up into the woods vehicle. I don't know why a nightclub would need a vehicle to go up in the woods, but it should, it should have one if, if it wants one. As you can see, this is the the paint scheme we're going to be going for, except with the livery on, so it matches. The th let's do that. Let's let's do this currently. Let's rev this up. I'm not saying that it's going to be better. I'm just saying that it's going to be more unique, and at least it'll fit a theme here. And I swapped out uh, the uh, position in the the uh, in the garage with the dubsta that I had, you know, that I grabbed off the street here during the time I was trying to. Source dubs to twos, and I didn't know what I was doing, and then I got frustrated, so I just grabbed one and I made it uh, look like it was half chrome, half gold. So I put that one up in the, the 4x4 warehouse. We'll go over that at some point. Still not doing a lot of fleet reduction here. I'm finding reasons to keep all the cars. Like this one, I really should sell it. Really, really. I, no one needs four Patriots. I have four. I can't remember what the other one was. I mean, I know, I'm pretty sure there's four Patriots. Let's see, there was the... What can the best mechanic in LS do for oh, you? Oh! Then I have a plain Jane White one, which has never been in Los Santos Customs, but it has a brush card that you can only have if you... Uh, that should do the trick. Yes, it's all revved up. You can only get if you don't. You only keep that if you don't bring it to Los Santos Customs, which means it is uh, not insured. Primary color and metallic. And where's the bright purple? It's down there somewhere. I think the purple is that far down. There we go. Bright purple. See it working already? It already kind of looks like the other one. We need a pearlescent on this. Light blue pearlescent is fine for what you might want to do, but I'm going because we're, we're, we're going for a certain look here. Reno red. There you go. Now it's, it's up there matching. Secondary color would be um, pure gold. I don't know if there's anything on here that is secondary. But we'll do we'll do that. It's good. Uh, roof mounted lights. See this? You have the strip lights that don't work. They're just there. They're not wired up right, and that just completely. I don't know. Maybe they fixed it for seven hundred bucks. We'll tell you. We'll see if they fix the lights. Um, wheels. Now, I, I don't know that I don't just want to change the wheel color here. Pink! There you go. No, it's, I believe gold doesn't really match gold very well in this game. That looks more like a tan, but the bronze actually kind of goes along with it, as I recall. That looks more like an actual... If, you're, if you had gold on it, that's what it would look like. So we, can put the, we can get bronze wheels on it. But, since we're not doing the dollars anyway, I mean, we could do dollars on it and white walls in the whole nine yards. Do we want to just leave them black? Do we want to... I don't know, I should have had a plan, shouldn't I? Black still works. We could leave the wheels alone. With the black wheels, because it'll pick up from the livery. And it still bring it that kind of... Turbo manliness. That's not good. Let's just leave them black. Tires, tires. Here, make sure that these. This these needs tires bulletproof tires. And put the tires back. There we go.
The only other thing I can think of, blue color, what if? You can't get Torino uh, red on it, so you can't even pull it up there properly. Alright, we're good. We're good. The enemy of good is better. Oh, windows. There we are. I think that works. Oh, you know what we need? First of all, make sure. Yes, it's got full coverage. Delivery. It's yeah, it's 90 sandbox, so it matches the other. It matches the limo. Exhaust. Primary, secondary. We could give it. We could give it gold exhausts. Which might work if we give it the gold wheels. Oh, it does have gold handles. Okay, that might work. Because that kind of works too. But that works. But only if. Where is the bronze? You see how it ties in? Is that gaudy enough? Let's look at the bumpers. Can we do the bumpers to a secondary? Front bumpers. Yes, we can. Secondary front. Secondary rear. Now, now you're tired. Now it's matching. Now we're up to speed here. Is there another anything on the front end here? I don't think so. I don't think we could change the, the actual front beyond the bumpers. Hood? Secondary sports hood? Are we have we tricked it out as much as we can? We're good here. Lights! It doesn't have lights. Oh goodness, how can you let's see first of all? The roof mounted lights don't freaking work and Rockstar is just wrong. Alright, I'm not tolerating that. What miracle did you want me to perform? The lights on the top don't work. Take them off. I'm not gonna pretend. We'll do that. We'll do neon kits. Yeah, color black light. Because it's for the club. You can actually check IDs like that. I should we just go with purple? I don't know. It'll be a special black light. I don't know. We're just gonna go with purple. Where is the freaking you know, roof mounted lights? No roof mount because it's the LED strip lights don't work. Take them off. Does the purple work for us? Yeah, it works well enough for now. Maybe we'll go with gold or something later on. But this is good enough for the club, for a club, a gaudy club, but yet still manly off road. We did leave the off road tires on it. See? Man, he just drives through things, drives over things, launches through the air, and heads back to the club. A little bit of turbo in there. Just a little bit of turbo. I mean, there's a lot of turbo moving through, it's really heavy, so it just seems just like a little bit of turbo in this. Oh, come on, that was snazzy. Just because it's snazzy in the video game doesn't mean you should try it in real life, kids. The physics here is not completely analog, you know? It's not the same thing. 
This is four, right? Yeah. I could, in theory, stack all of them in here, but it seems like it's the right thing to have the limo and the nightclub entrance, right? Right? And I could put something else in the nightclub entrance and then put them all together. You can see the limo a little bit better, but I don't know, it seems to work well. And I think like, like the limo is supposed to be there. Anyway, something we can always change later on. But I think it's time to acquire another vehicle. And not for this character, because this character, I don't even know if he has any garage space. There's not a lot. We're still, we're still working on some of that. So moving right along. You see, it's one thing to make... I'm about to get blown up, all right. Okay, let's get let's get back inside. Back inside. I was just outside uh, checking to see what garage to put this in. Okay, let's go back up to the penthouse. Let's not mess with anybody here for the short term. See the traditional livery for American racing cars and, and sports cars racing here is blue and white, not green and white. You see, for whatever reason, that car that you blast out the back of the truck, which I so carefully reproduced, is painted the wrong colors. It should be, if it's going to be in a, you know, if it's going to be a true classic 60s racer, it should be blue and white. And just for simplicity, let's put this someplace that we can work on it. Um, Arena Workshop B1. All right. Now we didn't read the description. Let's go back and read the description. The Mamba harks back to a simpler time in car design when the only real question was how much engine you could cram into an elegant frame before it tore itself apart. The Mamba harks back to a simpler time in car design when the only real question was how much engine could you cram into an elegant frame before it tore itself apart? Judging from the high mortality rate, the Class A hit a winning formula. But don't take our word for it. Once you hit the freeway and feel that primal roar beneath you as the bodywork starts to disintegrate, you'll know you made the right choice. And the one choice that wasn't made right is that it shouldn't be the Class A. It should be a Vapid. Everybody knows the Cobra runs a Ford engine. What are you guys doing? I mean, really. Really. I mean, really. Okay, that's not quite the right look here. I want this to have a true 60s feel. Okay. Obviously, armor it up. Because why not? Race brakes. Max the engine, exhaust, we'll go big more. Hood, I like the hood as it is. That's that's what I think of, you know, that hood's good, kind of hood scoop. Horn, no, we don't even worry about the horn. Lights are fine, livery. Now, it's either going to be white stripes, no. 63 and uh, 58 atomic, maybe. Atomic tire with that. That. I think I'm just, just going to go with the plain white stripes. Need the play alone for now. Respray, primary color, metallic, dark blue. Like, there's not even a consideration. Oh, yeah, lots of stuff will look good, but dark blue. Secondary color, we're going to match it. It only affects the, um, the, the part I'm going to have taken off anyway. Oh, there's a, I guess there's a little bit of side stuff going on here, too. Yeah, we want that to match. Where's the dark blue? Yes, yeah, we're definitely on, on track here. Roof, gone. Suspension, 
This time I think I will give it a sport suspension. I gotta put the other one to be stock. Transmission, race, turbo. Yeah, not truly. Yeah, you want to give it the most performance. Wheel type, we're gonna go muscle chrome. Yeah, revolver. Yeah, the spooners could work. But I think we're gonna go with revolvers. Yeah, mercenaries work. That's more of a dodge thing for me, you know. I don't know. I'd have to look it up. I wonder if they could, if they came with those. Hold on a second. Okay, I gotta give Rockstar some credit. I googled what the the Shelby you know Cobra wheels look like. And they look like the stock wheels for the most part. I mean, I would have rather them be a little bit less low profile. That's how they kind of look. I mean, it's... Yeah, I'm looking right now. I'm on my phone looking at Cobras. Again, they're not that low a profile. I mean, a muscle... It'd be nice if there was a similar muscle wheel that you could use, because it would definitely be more of a muscle thickness to it. That kind of works. If you if you look at the drag specials compared to the stock ones, not much different. The, the stock ones re really match the shape. The only problem is that they go really low pro I guess uh, let's not agonize over it. You know, let's no point in agonizing over it. Those kind of look all right, Leon, let's just leave them alone. Bulletproof tires. Leave the tire smoke alone. It'll smoke like they're supposed to. Windows. Leave that alone. Exit the arena. Yes. This. This is what I think of when I think of a Cobra. Let's see. What is... Someone's got it. So we'll just let that go. I'm not gonna go hunting anybody down right now. I'm not in the mood. I'm rarely in the mood. But I have won a Mamba like this. Pretty much since the game, it's a got the game. But it was always like, it's never really been that good. Like you're not gonna win any races like this. I mean, sports classic races. But it doesn't have, I think, the handle to keep up with the... Uh, it's missing something. I can't remember if it's top end or handling, but it's not going to keep up with the, say, a Turismo Plasma. But, I mean, it's on sale. It's a lot cheaper now. This is just something I've wanted to get. So now I have a blue one that is the proper... The proper colors for an American racer. And I have one that matches exactly the one that falls out of the truck. So I mean I think I think we're good here. Woo! 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 Now on that note, ladies and gentlemen. This is your black knight. Have a great night.